So man, listen, for the 25 years that I have known you, mm -hmm. right? Everybody that knows that you played a role in my life, yeah. in the church, <laughs> yeah. the number one question, they were mm -hmm. like, yo, is, is Will a man of faith? Does he love the Lord? <laughs> I'm like, yes. Okay, so what I want yeah. to tell, I want you to hear, you, from the you horse's can, mouth, you, are you, you a man of faith? You can't Do you get, love the Lord? You can't get where I get if you don't love the Lord. Exactly. You don't, you don't get to sit how I sit and move how I move if you right. don't love the Lord. Exactly. Uh, yeah, okay. you know, you, you'd be seeing a whole lot of other repercussions. <laughs> <laughs> got it. Okay, yeah. good, good, man. All right, so now that yeah. we got that out the way, exactly. man, this movie um, is for sure might be my favorite movie of yours, really? you know, and obviously we did Pursuit and of Happiness, did some, yeah. you know, and have done a lot of other films, yeah. but this movie, you embodied this character, like, and I didn't see any of you in him. Yeah. But here's the thing I thought was so amazing. To me, this movie is one of the most faith movies that I've ever Absolutely. seen. Absolutely, yep. There's a scripture that says, you know, faith uh, without works is dead. Mm -hmm. And faith is the, is the substance of things we hope for and the evidence of things we don't see. That's beautiful. This dude didn't know tennis. No, right. His daughters had never played. Mm -hmm. He created an 85-page play <laughs> on what was going to happen, what and he did not veer until it manifested. I wrote me a 78-page plan for their whole career before they was even born. The chances of achieving the kind of success that you're talking about, it's just very, very unlikely. Two years before they were born, Miss Orsini was, was around here, and we mm -hmm. talked about that today. and. You know, and that's what that was my question to her. I was like, so when he when he said that, yeah. you said yes. <laughs> <laughs> okay. But, I was like, why? But how do you connect you know, to his faith journey? Yes. You know, you and I have talked about you know my relationship with my grandmother. Yeah, and, Resurrection and, Baptist Church. Resurrection. <laughs> <laughs> <Exactly>. Resurrection <laughs> Baptist Church. You know, so that concept of of faith and that power of faith. Uh, you know, I'm, I'm gonna go. I might go. I might be going in a little too deep here, but there's nah, a there's a deep. distinction. Yeah. All right. So there's faith in God, and then there's knowledge of God. Absolutely. Right. Yep. So there's revelation. Some mm -hmm. people have had revelation. Yes. Right. So when when you have to have faith. Faith is before you've had revelation. Right. When you don't, you right. don't have to have faith because you know. Exactly. Right. So that's what Miss Orsine is. Mm. Right. And you talk to, I don't know if you've ever met her, but no, when I you talk her to her, it's, she's so solid mm. that she is completely, thoroughly, and totally certain. She doesn't walk in doubt. Mm. When you see Richard, it seems, you know, mm -hmm. like this big, crazy right, right. plan from this guy who's all over the place. But when you meet Miss Orson, you're like, okay, got it. <laughs> you're like, got right. it. My faith dictates that I stand by your side. All right, well, Don't just do mistake that my silence for agreement. That's how they did it. <laughs> right, right, because she was like she the was anchor. The, the anchor, you know, she said, in order to doubt, that means you don't trust God. Mm. And she said, there was never a moment of doubt. When we set out as a family, we knew we were going to do what was ordained. Man. You know, and I was like, whoa. <laughs> that's <laughs> but crazy. It, but it's that, that, that's that concept yeah. when it was so full and mm -hmm. it was, it was uh, family around this belief and they trusted God. Mm. And they, they believed that their devotion would be rewarded. Mm -hmm. And they never wavered. This world ain't never had no respect for Richard Williams, but they gonna respect y'all. But see, this is why, you know, in this conversation, we'll get as much as we can in, but mm -hmm. I want more people to understand, yeah. you know, your story yeah. as it relates to faith. Because yeah. I'm like, man, you are more spiritual than a lot of both. I'm like, I call you the bishop. Oh, no, right. I call you Pastor Smith because you have ministered to me and yeah. so many other people, and yeah. you are also ministering through this film. Yeah. You could have chosen any film that you wanted to do. Yeah. Why was it so important for you as you talk about these themes of faith and you talk about Miss Orsine and Richard, why was it so important for you to tell this story? So at, at this point in my career, I am, I'm taking films that are based on things. I'm sorry, the helicopter, hope that's not messing up. <laughs> at, at this point in my career, Divine, I'm well, telling I hear you, you, I hear you, I got you, I can hear it. <laughs> you know, at, at, at this point in, in my career, I'm taking 
films that are centered on ideas that I want to explore and ideas that I want to illuminate, mm -hmm. right? 20 years ago, I saw a video, Venus, a famous video, Venus yeah. is doing an interview, and we depicted it in the film, Venus is doing an interview, <laughs> and a guy keeps asking her, uh, you know, you say, you have, you know, you have faith that, you know, yeah, right, that right. you can, you yes. can do this. Why, you, you know, you seem so confident. Why? She said, because I am. And Richard interrupts the interview and says, you, you know, this, she, 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 she told, told you, you her answer. Well, her answer, <laughs> yes. right? Such leave her alone. Scene. One of the best leave, scenes in the movie. Leave that alone, right? That's it. She's nervous. Take a step up. Maybe she ought to take a few more steps up. Just get someplace safe. I saw the real one about 20 years ago, mm. and what I was looking at was Venus's face. And she is almost smirking, mm. right? And it was like she had a lion, and her yeah. lion defended her faith, right? And and I saw, and, and That's crazy. yeah, her lion defended Defended yeah. her faith. You're not gonna just be representing you, you're gonna be representing every little black girl on earth. They're not gonna let you doubt. How could you? I looked at that, I just thought that was such a beautiful mm. moment. And at the time, I, I couldn't comprehend yeah, why yeah, it was yeah. so beautiful to yeah. me, but that's how I wanted my daughter's face to look you know, yeah. when I showed up, yeah. right? And yeah. how do you cultivate that? And Richard yeah. Williams had cultivated that kind of love and certainty in in his children and, and in his family. So when the opportunity yeah. came up to play it, the, I was like, is that scene in there? Because I want I want to put that scene That's out it. in the world. Man, you know? man, listen, we got one last question. Yep. In terms of what you want to put in the world, mm -hmm. somebody's going to watch this film. How is it that you want someone as a person of faith to connect mm -hmm. to the message in this film? The, the simplicity of aligning your will with divine will. Mm. You, you don't have to have fear and you don't have to have doubt when you're in sync with your faith. Yes. Right? And yes. Those, those things like doubt and fear are in the absence of oh, God and faith, faith. Exactly. Right? right? Totally. It's very right. hard to it's, hold it's both. It's hard to time. hold both. <laughs> right, right, right. Right, you know, so that thing, and when you when you see this family and you, you see the amount of love and certainty, even through adversity, it doesn't absolutely. mean it's not adversity. You know, Usually the adversity, adversity is, is the requirement. It's the admission price. Yes, absolutely. For the faith, right? <laughs> yes, exactly. <laughs> you know, so I want people to, to see how they hold to one another mm -hmm. and how they hold to their faith. Um, and, and, and the dream is almost third. Mm. Right? Yeah. Their love, their family, and yes. their faith are first. And yes. that's the foundation yes. of everything. Yes. And then from that, the flowers mm. of their dreams will bloom. Wow. Dope, man. Listen, yeah. you know, we can talk about the guy all right? day long. <laughs> man. Appreciate Much you, man. Love, as, always, as always. For sure, Good man. Sir. Venus and Serena going to shake up this world.